Hi, my name is Kevin Smith. I'm an Agilent Applications Engineer for Oscilloscopes. Today, I'm going to show you how to save the maximum memory on a 2000X series scope. It's also worth uh, stating up front that, the, um, that with the 2.30 software revision, the um, max memory increased to 1 million points per channel with an upgrade key. Or, and, and without that memory up, upgrade, the um, <coughs> Is uh, it, it's now 100k per channel, whereas it was previously 50k per channel. So you should update your scopes. That's a free update. The uh, but the um, one mega point upgrade is um, a four pay license. It's pretty cheap though. It's about 200 bucks. All right. So I've got a signal here. Um, I want to save it. Um, so I'm going to hit the save recall hard key, then the save soft key. And there's a couple of different formats we can choose from. Um, the CSV format is what most people try first, and that's, that's fine, except that um, we're not going to get more than um, a certain amount of points, even if we stop it. Okay, um, So I said 100K. If I, turn, if I crank down the time base, you'll notice that more points are available. Okay, And basically, the CSV format is a representation of what we see on screen. What we really want to use is to use the ASCII XY format. Let me just go down there. This is still a CSV format, and um, it's going to work in Microsoft Excel. Okay, so I'm going to go to uh, uh, the settings. Okay, and I still get 5,000 or 50,000 rather. Well, that's because we were in run stop mode. Okay. Um, while it's running, you can only get to a certain number of points. If we hit stop, okay, I said there's 100K, basically you only fill up half the buffer. On the other hand, if we hit single, okay, I now get 100K points. Um, and one thing I really, really, really want to illustrate is, let's do a single here, okay. Notice, I only get 40 points. I have to bring the data on screen using the, large time, the larger time per, per division knob. Let's go to a long scale. And we notice that I get the 100K points. If I had the one mega point option on this scope, I, I, would, um, I could go to a longer time scale and get that um, and get the full one mega point. Now, one other thing I do want to point out, too, is that if we go to um, channels, if we turn on channel two and we do a single, okay, on many of our other scopes and other people's scopes, um, Turning on like channels one and two will actually split the memory depth. On the 2000X series, we split the sample rate but not the memory depth. Okay, so we go again. We go to save recall, save um, settings. Okay, max length, and I've got everything on screen already, um, and I still get the 100K points on two channels. Two other things I want to show you quickly. Uh, again, under the save recall menu, uh, save. Uh, file name, okay, um, this is where I can change the file name. I increment through the file name, uh, the, the spell bits with, um, with this knob, uh, and it can auto increment the file name. Um, now if we go under uh, the utility menu, utility hard key to quick action, we can also set the scope up to do a quick save. Okay, and then we get the settings, um, uh, you know, file name, set it, uh, all the same stuff I just showed you. And now every time I hit uh, quick action, it saves it. And that's, uh, that's what I wanted to show you. Thank you for your attention.